how to study patholma. Around the second year of medical school in the United States, students prepare to take the Step 1 exam. Pathology, or the study of diseases, is an important part of that test. Patholma is a website devoted to covering the in-depth pathology text of Dr. Hussain Sitar. To get the most out of Patholma, you should start by signing up for a full website membership. Then, it's important to carefully read through the texts and watch the available videos in tandem with your other study activities. Getting the most out of Patholma. Sign up for a Patholma account. Go to www.patholma.com slash sign dash up. There you can read about the variety of membership options available, including a free one-month trial. Most med students get the most benefit out of signing up for the 21-month access package, which gives you full video and text access. This also means that you can download materials onto your phone for 24-7 study access. To sign up for an account, you'll need to provide your name, address, and current school affiliation. You'll also have to agree to be the only user for your account. An account costs $84.95 for 3 months, $99.95 for 12 months, or $119.95 for 21 months. To sign up for an account, you'll need to provide your name, address, and current school affiliation. You'll also have to agree to be the only user for your account. An account costs $84.95 for 3 months, $99.95 for 12 months, or $119.95 for 21 months. Put together a study group. Find a group of classmates or friends who are at a similar stage in medical school. Create a study schedule that you all can stick with over time. Devote at least a portion of your time each meeting to discussing Pathoma and its materials. Some groups also use this as an opportunity to share a single membership to the Pathoma website, although this is prohibited according to the website's membership terms. Some groups also use this as an opportunity to share a single membership to the Pathoma website, although this is prohibited according to the website's membership terms. Read straight through the text at least once. You can either do this online or with a hard copy of the book. Give yourself ample time to make your way through it in 45-minute reading segments. Try not to take notes this first go-round, just enjoy the material and try to get a feel for the full coverage of the book. This is also useful if you are trying to decide between going with Pathoma or Golgen's Rapid Review. The Pathoma text is over 200 pages long, so don't expect to make your way through it in only a day or two. This is also useful if you are trying to decide between going with Pathoma or Golgen's Rapid Review. The Pathoma text is over 200 pages long, so don't expect to make your way through it in only a day or two. Make a flashcard for all important facts. Each time that you encounter a particular definition, term, or explanation that you need to know by memorization, write it on a note card. This goes for the material found in the text, study aids, and visual materials. You can also color code your cards by theme for easy reference. For example, you can put each separate definition on a pink card. You can even sketch quick illustrations onto the cards. This can be especially useful when studying the cell structure of certain diseases. If paper cards aren't your thing, use Anki or Firecracker to make electronic cards. These can be saved to your phone, so that you can study anywhere and anytime. For example, you can put each separate definition on a pink card. You can even sketch quick illustrations onto the cards. This can be especially useful when studying the cell structure of certain diseases. If paper cards aren't your thing, use Anki or Firecracker to make electronic cards. These can be saved to your phone, so that you can study anywhere and anytime. Teach the Pathoma site to non-medical friends or family. This is a creative way to approach a study session. When you are pretty comfortable with the Pathoma site, sit down with a friend and let them browse through it. Encourage them to ask lots of questions, so that you can explain what they are seeing or hearing. This lets you become the teacher, which is a great way to learn more. Look at the same information over and over again. Anyone who is familiar with studying complex material knows that repetition is key. Go through your note cards until you can repeat the information back quickly and easily. Read over the same portions of the text multiple times. Watch the videos repeatedly until you can predict what comes next. 